Hi, this is Martin Brennan from Imagineer Systems with a quick tip on how to align your camera inside HitFilm 2 Ultimate. So here we are inside HitFilm 2 Ultimate and we've already got a scene set up from a previous tutorial I've done. Uh, we haven't set up anything pretty like shadows or anything, but we've got a nice movement locked onto the shot with that 3D model. Now with situations like this, even though we've got a nice model set up here and the camera's moving around correctly in the scene and all that kind of thing, sometimes what we'll get is a floor plane that doesn't quite look correct in the shot. And it's much nicer to work with a floor plane that looks like it's sitting correctly in the scene. So how do we align this floor plane to match the rest of our 3D objects in the shot? It's quite simple, we can do this by aligning everything to a single point. So let's do that now. I'm going to create a new layer and create a point. And let's just call this alignment point. And I'm going to make that alignment point a 3D plane. Once we have this point, we then select all of the objects that are related to our Mocha data. So we've got our 3D model and our camera from Mocha and all of our points that were generated from the Mocha Solve. Once we have all these selected, we can choose any of these layers, drop downs, to parent that to the alignment point. Now all of these selected layers are hooked up to this alignment, and we can start orientating the alignment point in the scene. So I'm going to just drop down to my transform tools and use the orientation value to orient this point in the scene. We could also use the handles inside the viewer but sometimes it's easier to tweak the values down in the layers. So I'm going to start first by just moving my X up a little bit, just so we get it about there. And I might just align this a little bit just to make sure that we're sitting OK in the Z axis as well. We may even decide to rotate around our Y just to get that nice and lined up here on the side of the phone booth. And we'll just tweak that a little bit more. So we just eyeball this to make sure it's looking about correct in the shot. Usually good to try and work out about where that horizon is back there. So we'll go with about there for the time being. So once we've got this, we want to make sure that our model is sitting correctly in the scene. If I play this back, we can see a little bit of drift going on because we're not sitting quite correctly in the shot after doing this orientation. So how we fix that is we can go up to views and I'm going to choose three views here. And we can see here that our alignment point is sitting right at zero, zero, but our model is floating right up in space. So I'm going to bring this axis point down so our model is sitting right on that zero point. And then we can go back to the original view and have a look. So even though it looks like our floor plane is hovering up, it's a bit of an optical illusion because it is still sitting on this ground plane. But as we go through, we can see how well that now is locked onto our scene compared to before where it was drifting around all over the place. So now if we go back to our three views, that model is sitting on the zero zero plane and our camera is moving around correctly within that area. So it's just that easy. You just simply align all of your points to one parent point and then make sure your camera and model are connected to that as well and you don't connect your 2D footage layer and then you can just quickly view and align that point in 3D space and then make sure that it's sitting in the right spot within your shot just to make sure that you check for drift. So that's how you can quickly align your floor plane inside HitFilm 2 Ultimate to match your Mocha camera data within the scene. This has been Martin Brennan for Imagineer Systems.